Hey guys, welcome back to the show. We made it to Friday. Today, we are gonna learn how to spot a casting scam. Here are a few common red flags to watch out for. Spelling mistakes or incorrect grammar, obvious broken English, email addresses written out with parentheses or special characters, anyone who says they can make you a star, and promises of paying you in advance. Now, if you're tuning in this week, you definitely want to take notes. So get your pen and paper out. I'm gonna give you all the details on scams. The first thing you should do if a casting notice seems suspicious is to ask more questions. Legit casting directors will be happy to provide clarity while scammers tend to dig themselves into a deeper hole. For example, you can ask for more details on things like the shooting locations, call times, links to previous productions, and how exactly the pay is being structured. When you speak with a casting director, make sure you keep conversations on the casting website. This is very important, so pay attention. If a casting director wants to take the initial conversation about a casting call into a private email exchange, then you should explain that you feel more comfortable communicating through the casting website messaging system. This method keeps potential scammers from getting access to your personal email addresses and protects you from spam or scam messages. Now, with any job you book or audition you are called in for, you always want to document as much as possible. To make sure everything is legit, you must document everything. This will keep the details clear for everyone and it gives you something to refer to if there is a callback or if you want to remember what exactly took place. Another great way to determine if a casting call is fake is to reach out to the website admin. Any legit casting site will strive to maintain a safe environment for talent and keep their quality high. Chances are they will be grateful you gave them the heads up. Here are some other ways you can easily protect yourself against scams by following these steps. Step one, Google the name of the casting director or company with the word scam after it. Step two, copy and paste the casting notice into Google and check for search results. Step three, check websites like ripoff report and scam busters for any other reports. Now, I'm gonna share a quick story about how I almost got scammed. <laughs> Brace yourself for this one, okay? <laughs> I received a text message from an unknown number one time from a casting agency who magically found my social media profile and said they liked what they saw and they wanted to set up a callback to audition. But here's the thing. I didn't recognize the name of the company, nor did I submit myself for an audition. So then I asked them for more details about the casting project. All of a sudden, they said, we don't have all the details yet until they officially released the production dates. <laughs> so then I said, I'm not interested at this time, but thank you for your consideration. <laughs> Good thing I did that because I literally searched the name of the casting company on Google and there were over 50 scam reviews on them. Can you believe that? <laughs> Tons of innocent people said they were scammed out of thousands of dollars for so-called Hollywood actor package deals that ended up being payment scams. That's one huge red flag you definitely want to avoid in this business. Never ever pay up front for a job. This is how the casting process works. Whenever you have talent representation or an agent, the agent will take 10 to 15% of commission on whatever project you were casted on. Then you will receive a flat rate payout once the job is done. Now, if you don't have an agent, you will most likely get all of the money that was posted on the casting call. It just depends. Here are some legit websites to find some casting calls in your area. Backstage, Casting Networks, 
Actors Access, IMDB Pro, which stands for Internet Movie Database, Playbill, Casting Frontier, Now Casting, and New York Castings. You can also check out your local film commission website, which is normally located under your state governor's office. My state, for example, is called the Texas Film Commission. There are tons of resources for casting calls on there. And there is also an events calendar where you can find industry-related workshops, panels, networking events, festivals, and conferences. Also, check out my description box below <laughs> to find some great resources to help you on today's topic regarding scams. All right, guys, we are officially done. Yay, we made it. <laughs> if you have any questions, please feel free to contact me on my official business email, D Brown, my first initial of my name, my last name, Brown, <laughs> at cuethestage.com. I'll see you next time. Have a great weekend. Take care now. Bye-bye.